<laughs> well, a lot of people are going to maybe be putting food down their drains that they shouldn't today. You're being really uh, careful with uh, what you're saying. Well, I know. <laughs> uh, Mike Donnelly from Donnelly Heating and Plumbing is here. Uh, I just wanted to say real quick, our boss put something on Facebook that he had lettuce coming up through his toilets. Is that bad? <laughs> <laughs> you think? <laughs> this, is uh -oh. not, this is not the direction we want this segment to go through. So this is the time of year, though, when we've got tons of visitors, tons of food, and some of it ends up in there, and that's a problem. Sure. You don't want one of our guys coming over and having Thanksgiving yeah. with you. So um, the first thing is let's talk about a little bit of prevention. And before you start cooking and clean or getting ready for Thanksgiving, Put a tray of ice cubes down. You, know, you start the water, start to dispose. I'll run ice in there. And then you could also cut up a lemon and put it in there. And uh, What does the ice do? The ice just cleans it out, cleans the blades. Okay. And, and the, the acid in the lemon will help the smell. OK, All right? then makes sense. Second is, is now, now we what not to put down or how to how to take care of it. When you're cleaning off the table, use the garbage can, not the sink. Okay. Okay. People use their disposal as a right. garbage a lot yeah. of times, and, right? And the more, if you put a bunch of food down there, it's probably gonna, gonna get plugged up. So next, it's a couple of things that don't work is potato peels, rice, oh my pasta. Gosh, yes. Anything that is starchy will expand with water and can plug up the drain. And so many people think like, you know, shavings of whether it's potatoes or carrot peels, that it's all okay, but that all can cause problems. They okay. can all cause problems. The other thing we find is uh, the stickers off of fruit or oh, the lemons yes. get stuck in the disposal all the time. And then how to use it is whenever you're using your disposal, start the water first, get it flowing. Does it right? matter what uh, temperature is it at? Do you want hot or does you it matter? You want cold water. Oh, you want so, cold water? Right, okay. so cold water. So when you do use hot, all the grease comes loose and it tends to stick to the pipes and things like that. And then you start the disposal and then when you feed the disposal, do it like when you're eating. You, you know, you take a bite, small bite, you chew, 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 and then you take another bite. Same thing here as you batch feed it, you feed a little bit in, and you you can usually hear when it's And real working. quick, sometimes they'll lock up on you and you can just right. free it right there, right? Right, so there's a breaker yeah. or a reset button here. On the bottom. If it, if it locks up, exactly. And then, you know, have your plunger exactly. close yeah. by. Now, for, the, for the lettuce in the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> Mike, uh, thank you so much. I think we're out of time, right? Uh, we appreciate you coming by. Right, Hope thank you. We won't see you at our house yeah, now because you know. we don't like you. <laughs> right. um, you know, just... well, you do not want problems exactly. like plumbing problems on Thanksgiving I when know. people might be needing to use the bathroom. So exactly. <laughs>